everyone, my name is Linda, so Lisa. We are in team. Our team's picture is so amazing. Today we want to introduce you to our picture about uh, the new IGS school in our imagination. So firstly, in IGS school, there are everything and students can balance their time. Firstly, a special thing about IGS is the woods. Now, uh, many people say the woods isn't important, but actually it is because it is home to many animals and you know what? Tree, the woods have many trees and trees re produce fresh air, fresh air for us to breathe. So, uh, there are, you can have relax, you can relax after a stress day at school by uh, going, going to, to the cafe. cafe or hotel or maybe the cinema. And IGS can provide necessary facil facility from subways to highways. And there are also buses and underground roads too. Yeah. So the next thing is about uh, the beach. Some people say the beach is not necessarily important, but actually it is because it is a part of students' fresh day tailbacks. Um, you know, sometimes students love to go to the beach and go snorkeling, go diving, and go sailing. Yeah, they so might balance their stress and their day. So the beach needs to be clean to be called a beach. Yes. So what do you think and what do you imagine if the beach is polluted? So it would be worse, like the sightseeing is bad. And All you can see is trash. Yes. Of trash. And there are no fish, uh, sea, sea creatures uh, go to extinct. So there are many things that have been affected by the beach. Next is the mountains. Very many people say mountains not important. No, 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 not important at all, but actually it is. It's very important because it grows lots of trees and it is home to many animals, like this orange koala. There's no orange koala in the world, so don't try to search for it. It's just my imagination. And there's this house. It's cute. It could be a mini museum. And uh, you know how to get up it? Get up to the mountain? All you have to do is drive here. No. Get get by the bus, get here, you can go into the woods by the bridge or go this way. Up here. So uh, as you know in our picture there are two solutions that IGS have resolved is about water pollution and air pollution. The air is very clean and even though we use subways, there are there are no pollution in the air. And also, people are using the beach real much. The beach is very clean. Yeah, and there are rarely trash. So, IGS have resolved uh, two things is about pollution, is water pollution and air pollution. How type of land pollution? Okay, IGS have resolved land pollution by making more trees. And they planted more flowers and stuff here. The, do you know why? Because trees can stop uh, soil from from uh, they can stop it from weathering. So uh, the there are more soil for people to use plant. to use for their activities and also plant. So if you want to take a walk, don't take a walk on the plants. You can take a walk here. This is the only walkway. It's very long, but it is also not underground. But there's not much space, so it's just teeny bit. But that teeny bit can 
to turn into a megabit, right? Okay, so after all, IGS have solved many problems, like they can, uh, they can, uh, they can provide uh, necessary Trees. facilities, uh, nature, and also water pollution, air pollution, and they can also help us about, they can help us to provide more space. So, uh, overall, I think IGS will become better in the future and there are, there will be more things that IGS will improve in our current world, like bring nature closer to us. I hope that in the future, um, students will spring into action and make the world a better place. Make IGS a better place and the world a better place, not turn it into, into Venus. So that is the end of our presentation. And we hope that all our imagination and what we think of our of the new IGS school will be will, will come true will come true true in the future. Yeah. Thank you for listening. Goodbye, Bye. gentlemen. Sit down.